The angular speed of a car engine is increased from 1170 revolutions per minute to 2880 revolutions per minute in 12.6 seconds. Letter A, find the average angular acceleration in revolutions per minute squared. And letter B, how many revolutions does the engine make during this time? So for this problem, the assumption is that the car engine has a component that exhibits rotational motion and that that component accelerated from an initial velocity of 170, 1170 revolutions per minute to a final angular velocity of 2880 revolutions per minute and it does so in just 12.6 seconds so we're trying to find out what the acceleration was for that engine during that span of time so now we can solve that actually knowing that for our given the initial angular velocity is 1170 our final angular velocity is 2880 so it increased in a span of um, a time interval of 12.6 seconds here the initial time is set to be zero so the final time is set to be 12.6 now we are using minutes for this particular problem because um, that's what the problem asked us to do so we might as well convert the time interval to minutes and by doing that we obtain um, 0 0.21 minute for our time interval so we can now use the very very straightforward problem we can use the formula for the average angular acceleration delta omega over delta time this is the definition of angular acceleration it's a rate of change of the angular um, velocity and so by substituting our values we obtain um, the result we're trying to figure out how fast this engine changes its um, angular velocity and we discovered through substitution that um, the change is 8,140 8 revolutions per minute squared or 8,140 revolutions per minute each minute so for letter B how many revolutions does the engine make during this time I'm sure this is a very large number because the acceleration is quite high we use that formula uh, that we derived in the previous activity the second kinematic equation and so we just substitute values it's a long solution so let's put it down here and just draw an arrow there and by substituting the values we obtain um, delta theta how many revolutions 425 revolutions in just 12.6 seconds wow what a fast engine so that's it and i hope you enjoyed this problem thank you very much